morning everybody it is week two for Halloween makeup I hope you guys like the first carnage look spoiler alert the second look is gonna be like a porcelain doll china doll type of look I want to make it kind of creepy carnage the I was supposed to put a photo to give you guys a reference photo of the type of comic carnage look I was going for and I didn't do that I'm sorry this one hopefully I'll remember so I'll go put up kind of like a photo of what I'm going for here today. It's kind of like a creepy look. So I'm gonna drink my coffee, I'm gonna set up station over here, and we're gonna get started very shortly. I'm excited for this one because I don't think it'll be super detailed and stressful like how the Carnage one was, how I had to get in all the crevices for the teeth. So I'm looking forward to this one a little more. I will see you guys in just a second. Now that it looks like I'm naked, it's just a tube top so I can draw on my chest if I need to. I'm going to put some contacts in. If you're one of those people that get grossed out from people touching their eye, give this video a thumbs up. I'm going to go ahead and take off my makeup. I don't know how much I'm going to end up talking in this video. Just heads up. I do like seeing these videos sped up so you can kind of see the process and how it goes from nothing to the end product. Also coconut oil is a lot more effective than the micellar makeup remover. For this doll look a lot of the pictures that I have for reference the dolls have a lot lighter eyebrows than I have. Mine are pretty dark and when I put makeup on it makes my eyebrows even look darker. So I'm wondering if I should glue down my eyebrows and just make a whole new set of eyebrows or if I should just lighten the eyebrows that I already have. I'm gonna try brush it whichever way I think they want to go so it can lay as flat as it can. This is nice because it's such a huge glue stick. So it's like you know it's getting the entire eyebrow. I'm just putting kind of a thick layer on. It's fun gluing your eyebrows down though. Something about it, like just flattening all these hairs up here, just like feels right. I don't know how white of a base I want to make, so I'm just gonna go for it, I guess. I really like this by the way. It's super smooth and buttery and easy to use. This is so good if you want to start getting into this and be an amateur like me. I have going so far. I'm going to try add some different strokes and colors into it to make it look more defined. So I'm going to do that off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. I added some different types of brown into it. Actually, what worked pretty well was using a foundation to do these eyebrows because since the skin tone is going to be literally the color white, foundation was a good shade to make light eyebrows. So, all right. Yes? No, no, no. Ah, good girl. Now I'm gonna start with the eye look. Now I don't really know what I want to do exactly. We're just gonna go for it. I wanna use this peachy shade actually because it's kind of what I was looking for anyways. I 
think I want to go in with a more pink shade to go on top of this. It looks too much of like a skin color. I think I'm going to try to do this peachy shade instead. Now I'm going to add a little bit of blush. I'm kind of going to add it in more of the contour area instead of on the apples of the cheeks. Just going by the reference photo. Okay, eyeliner is on. I am going to go ahead and accentuate my beauty mark. Because not only does my reference picture has it, but I have a beauty mark right here anyway, so. I mean, why not? I'm trying to drag that white color a little down to open up the eye. Lashes. We got one lash on. Now that I touched up a little bit, I think I'm going to put on the last final pieces and I will be right back with the final look. I'm gonna have to take these contacts out because they I can't see anything. <laughs> okay you guys, so that pretty much completes this makeup look. I thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Week three is coming up soon, so stay tuned for that. Be sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.